go. Your main event for the evening. Roy Wills versus Duke. Sponsored by Mala and TKO. Who have you got, Muggsy? <laughs> well, I'm going to be... I'm going to sit on the fence here commentating. <laughs> Don't sit on the fence. No, I've got Roy. <laughs> Fair enough. It's going to be a good fight, though. Yeah, well, Roy took out the last... Um, the last time I fought, I think Roy took it out. So only just... So have these two fought before? Yeah, yeah. Right, okay. As you can imagine, a kick fight. But I think, yeah, Roy just um, scaled the win, so... We shall see. Yeah, he's got Roy. He can. He likes to walk forward pit style, but he also likes to counter. Then you've got Duke, that very beautiful Thai style, and it, he's had over 150 odd fights, and, and it shows. Yeah. So definitely not going to be uh, not going to be easy for either of them. I always feel like um, Roy does better when he fights someone more aggressive. He seems to, all from the fights I've watched of his, when he fights someone who's more aggressive, who walks him down, he seems to fight better. But he can fight aggressively, which is... And, they, and they've both already... Put in a fighter. Yep, and they've both already fought three rounds. Yeah. So hopefully, you know, they're both... Well, not 100%, but they're both good, Not to, no injuries. Plays a massive factor in a four-man, doesn't it? Or even, like, eight-man. It's like, even if you get through that first round, are you are your shins okay? Or what type of injuries do you have? Yeah, and they've got to also keep warm. You don't want to, yeah. you don't want to completely cold down. Exactly. And your body, your body might, might seize up. You can't eat that... A cookie or a chocolate bar after the first fight? No, you'd have to have like a, a, a banana or some sweet potato, <laughs> some some, keep, keep some carbs, get that energy levels up. Final words from Blair. Who knows what he's saying? <laughs> <laughs> Whatever he's saying, he'll be saying it with intensity. Yeah. Left kick very quick. And again. Again, Roy coming over the top with a hook. Good. I want, I want to see Roy let his hands go. I want to see him punch and then kick. He's got such strong hands, but he sort of just um, will sit back and kick. Both exchanging kicks there. Low kicks from Duke. Nice little exchange by those two. Definitely. It's similar to the first fight. Sneaking a little elbow there by Duke. 
Both my even in the clinch. Absolutely. I think Roy maybe looks a little bit physic physically stronger, but took using his body yeah, weight against him. I mean, to me, um, it just looks small for um, this weight division. Still with power, obviously. Oh, good tape. Roy chopping away at that lead leg. Oh, beautiful knee there by Brook. Roy comes back with a leg kick, and that's the end of round one. A good round by both lads. Definitely. Yeah, he's going to land that every time. Right leg kick. Good balance there by Duke. Both guys really working well in the clinch. Yeah, both very even in the clinch, in my opinion. Oh. doing those 12 to 6 el downward elbow shots. Was that a headbutt then? What's that, Mungy? I oh, just said, was that a headbutt then? Oh, I'm sure they sneak a few in there somewhere. <laughs> <laughs> strong on the clinch with the stance, knee for knee. Round two, over. He asked me at round one who oh. I give it to, I didn't know, but I'd probably say I'd give round two to do. Here we go, round three. Final round.
lovely oh, that's body kick. Snapping left kick. I mean, flooring of knees, but not really like damaging or not really like a high scoring knee. They, they may not be damaging, but they're still going to be scoring. They're scoring, but they're not really landing on the body, more like the, the legs. So, I mean, it depends how each judge is scoring it. That left kick is definitely scoring though. Yeah, it's definitely fine. Yes. It never head. seems like razzled by anything, does he? Always composed, even when he's like caught up on the ropes. That's just that experience. Yeah, you never see him like never poker, complete poker face. Thirty seconds to go. Oh, Roy gives up his back. Yeah. Both fighters having a quick glimpse at the time. And there you have it. find out who's got the decision. Be interesting to see um, who gets this one. Alright guys, that was our <laughs> four man final. Well done gentlemen. I think we're going to take a moment just to appreciate uh, how, how fortunate we are here in WA to have someone like Duke here, this good, some fighter, this good, working and fighting with some of our guys, giving our guys opportunities to fight him. It's really good for, really good for WA Muay Thai. Thank you, Duke. <laughs> Judges came to their decision and it was unanimous to the blue corner. Well done, Duke. Great fight, man. There you have it, guys. The blue corner, Duke from Bailey's. Yeah, well-deserved win there by Duke. I don't think you are... Uh, yeah, I, I don't think you can argue it, can you? Yeah, no, you can't argue with that. I would have been, been happy for either of them to win. All right, that's it from us. That's Nomination it from us. Muay Thai over. The next fight show for um, Pure Adrenaline Muay Thai is Development Day. Development Day. December 5th. December 5th at the so, Serbian, Serbian Club. Keep an eye out, guys. Over and out. You. Thank you.